Hey, good evening, Map here, Map Investments. So I'll do a video on the um, stock market and economic news, earnings um, here on Stock Tweets. Um, we got here trending Robinhood uh, to the downside, horrible earnings. Microsoft up nicely. Atom uh, token up 15%. Some biopharma got cut by 72%. Some small pump and dump up 270. You got Boeing tomorrow morning. M phase after hours did good. Hopefully it crosses 200. AMD uh, had earnings. Uh, looks like, I don't know, it's pretty flat. Uh, QS had earnings. We'll have to read and see how they did. And Litecoin is trending. Sorry. Oof. Long day. Here are some of the um, earnings um, from this morning and this afternoon on Stock Tweets. I love this uh, little app. Very helpful. End phase. I could use it over 200. General Electric up 2%. Microsoft up uh, over 2.5%. Two, two Twitter up over 2.5%. Uh, Google, I guess, uh, they're back in the green because I saw them down after hours. Visa down, Robin Hood down, Lockheed Martin got hit pretty hard. Uh, these UPS had a good earnings. Wow, well, waste management, 160. My friend used to buy that at 120 all the time. That thing has gone up, wow. Corning down five, they do glass, pretty big name. Capital One down five, uh, 568, Hasbro up two bucks. Perion Network up 30%. Teradyne up f almost 4%. Well, we're in the heart of, uh, of earning season, so it's a lot of earnings. Just scrolling to see what sticks out here. Always good to, to be uh, engaged with the stocks and see what's moving, what's not, so you can pick up on some stuff, trends, etc. Um, I did do some earnings trades later in the afternoon, right before uh, the close. I got a little break. Uh, picked up the laptop and took a little break for myself to see what was out there today. Um, just scrolling, it's just a lot of earnings. And I think tomorrow is a lot more. Tomorrow we have 240. So tomorrow is a lot of earnings. And then Thursday, another 267. You have Apple, Amazon, some big names. Tomorrow in the morning, you got Boeing and General Motors. <clears throat> um, on the trade front, see, I did some earnings trade. Didn't really do much. We got the futures right here. Let's take a look at the dollar. Dollar hanging around 94, a little bit under. Foreign currencies are mixed. Aussie at 75, pound at 137, loonie at 80, euro at 116, yen at 87 uh, Bitcoin down 1500 oil down 56 SP down a smidge a dollar 50 gold got sold off today 1790 under 1800 beef continues to climb uh, and hogs are pretty low so maybe pork chops are cheaper they should be cheaper because hogs have gone down if you look at the chart in the last month let's say yeah you see pretty down from 92 to 72 um what do we got what else NASDAQ turned red, down 15. Dow Jones down 12. 
Nikkei down 50. Platinum and Palladium pretty stable. Natural gas right under six bucks. Silver over 24. VIX creeping back up. Grains a little down. Bonds 10 year and 30 year down means interest rates higher higher on uh, the order front one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen about fourteen trades on my break um earning trades um very small trades um AMD, um, most of them done for credits, except Enphase was done for a debit of 87 cents. I bought the 200 and sold the 210 call, and Enphase is at 195, up like $20 after hours. So I'm hoping this thing just keeps blasting through and I can make some money on that call debit spread that I paid 87 cents for $87 uh, Robin Hood got me and I don't know why I didn't do anything for a credit I got suckered into Robin Hood so that'll be a loser and um, that was pretty much on the trade front uh, these were trending LIDR uh, was trending um was upgraded uh high was nine low was 525 pretty much close on the low they have to do with autonomous driving i did it for a 45 cent credit uh put sold the put credit spread and then bought a call out with it brpm is stock i bought a little bit this one also was bumping they signed an agreement with uber it was up big, hit 27 on a day, closed on the lower end. So I put something on there. Uh, AMD, we'll see. Google, we'll see. Microsoft, these are all earning trades. See how they play out tomorrow. I really don't pay attention to the after hours. Uh, on the trending front, SEAH was trending. ASTS was trending. Uh, the rest are earnings trades. And uh, Trump stock was hit today, closed down at 56, and I sold the put credit spread at the uh, on the down. I uh, sold the 40.35 for a dollar fifty. Probably could have got more if I were a little bit more patient. Um, we still got a lot of economic. Uh, economic um, report um, what do you call it uh, earnings reports we have a lot of earnings reports and uh, on the economic calendar on the 27th uh, what do we have PPI I don't know if this is accurate it says 345 in the morning I don't know if that's accurate uh, it says PPI, M3 money supply, but that's for Central European Central Bank. We have durable goods orders at 830. What else? EIA report, some auctions, retail sales. I don't know if that's for tomorrow because that's 750 p.m. That's what th this is what the economic calendar looks for tomorrow and we have over 200 earnings and the markets are a little bit of red I mean markets have been very strong and resilient uh, take a look at the indexes on stock charts like this little chart gives me a good little illustration I like looking at it Here's the S&P 500. I mean, how many consecutive updates have we had? One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten nights. Like ten days, no? Actually, we have one red day there. I don't know, but it just seems like... RSI is almost at 67. No, oh, it is at 67. Oh, approaching 70. Q's. Similar. On the Q's. Let's look at the diamonds. Pretty up there. Uh, let's see. Small up. Uh, no thanks. Small caps. IWM. Pretty up. Uh, pretty just up there. At resistance for the most part. Um, commodity wise, let's take a look at the gold chart. That gold is there. Uh, it does have a little bit of trend here. You can get over that 200 day, it'll be good. Uh, that's gold. Let's take a look at Silver SLV. Looks like it's trending a little bit higher there. UNG, uh, natural gas. Nice trend there. So we shall see. Uh, markets are in a little bit of... Uh, maybe they consolidate. But right now we have a little bit of red going into tomorrow morning. Uh, a pullback would be healthy. I mean, I don't, I don't remember the last day we, last day we had a sell-off. Um, so, so we covered the earnings, uh, the futures, what was trending, the trades. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have. Uh, Economic-wise, the news today, we just had earnings, and I went over the earnings. I don't remember the... So we got MFA surges, so hopefully that blast over 200. Microsoft did good. I think that was pretty much it. Anyways, like, subscribe. Um, chime in, and I'll catch you on the Philips side. Be safe. Have a good night.